Although David Beckham retired six years ago, the former England captain remains one of the world's most famous people, if not asterisk the asterisk world's most famous person. The 43-year-old enjoyed a glittering career in professional football, winning a host of major honours with his beloved Manchester United, Real Madrid, Los Angeles Galaxy and, finally, Paris Saint-Germain. But Beckham is somebody who has transcended the sport. It's not just football fans who know everything about him, the whole world does. Subsequently, Man United have pulled off a real coup by convincing Beckham to return to Old Trafford on the 26th of May for the 1999 Champions League reunion match against Bayern Munich. It's unlikely the Red Devils will now have any trouble filling their stadium for the event. Beckham will line up alongside Paul Scholes, Nicky Butt and Jesper Blomqvist in midfield on the 20th anniversary of the original match at the Camp Nou. Scholes, who quit as Oldham Athletic boss after 31 days in charge of the League 2 club on Thursday, did not play in the 1999 final because of suspension, but he will take the place of Ryan Giggs. The midfielders will be reunited with the full 1998 forward slash 99 defence, including Gary and Phil Neville, Sharp Stam and Dennis Irwin, with Peter Schmickel in goal. United will be managed by the legendary Sir Alex Ferguson, who has made a remarkable recovery after suffering a brain hemorrhage last May. I'm so excited to be going back to Old Trafford Beckham was quoted as saying by BBC Sport. Nineteen ninety nine was such a massive year for us so recreating that moment is going to be really special he added. To be back together as a squad and to be managed by the boss again is a huge dot I can't wait. It was his corner that led to Teddy Sheringham equalising dot from the same side, minutes later, he then whipped in the corner that resulted in Ole Gunnar Solskjaer scoring arguably the most iconic goal in United's history. Without Beckham, United may not have won their second European Cup that evening. The former midfielder is, if anything, a little underrated when people look back on his career these days. Make no mistake about it, Beckham was an absolutely brilliant footballer who was lethal from dead ball situations. He also worked tirelessly on the pitch, both for his clubs and his country. Although he left United under a cloud following a fallout with Ferguson, it's great that the two have patched things up since.